Thank you for the time given to me to present this uh, research. The title of the research is with assessment into teaching introducing course with a learning system to improve vocational teaching quality as defense innovations. My name is Yaman Subihati, I'm from Universitas Pendidikan Ganesa, Bali, Indonesia. Okay. The introduction as the first is. Um, so, the assessment is the application and use of various ways and tools to obtain a series of information about learning outcomes and competency achievement. Process assessment, planning, and learning cannot be separated from the learning planning itself. And there are several reasons why digital assessments is important to assess learning outcomes. It can save time, make the learning process more comprehensive and friendly provide quick feedback and provide feedback weekly. Okay, the benefit of the uh, conducting of digital assessment for the teaching course are that students can provide feedback, cognition and metacognition process, increase motivation, collaborative learning process, self leverage learning and improve performance. The micro teaching lecture process is carried out online because this peer assessment to be very important to do based on the above problem. It is necessary to have a with this digital process system for focus micro teaching lectures. This digital assessment system is packaged with a peer assessment model where its student will become uh, a peer reviewers and integrated with Unixa learning. This process will cause various positive learning environment, one of which is improving its other ability according to other assessors, constructive comments in addition and independent and adaptive learning process will be created there uh, where the student will be directly involved in the learning process and assessment process and for self introspection is one of the advantage uh, of peer assessments. And this to this studies aims to develop a digital peer assessment for recruiting course. Okay. Uh, we use a G model in this uh, research. So for the first uh, step in AG model is analysis. Number two uh, is design and the third is development, uh, implementation and the last is evaluations. Okay, for the first step is analyze uh, pieces. We analyze the curriculums and the needs of uh, when this assessment system was conducted at the analysis stage. And number, uh, the second is the side stage uh, was to carry out curriculum mapping of learning outcomes that have been carried out uh, at the analysis stage. The learning outcome were mapping into uh, several egg indicators and uh, 26 sub indicators to measure student teaching ability offline and online teaching coaching. And the third is develop. Uh, this stage was to integrate rubric and assessment grid that have been developed, analyzed, and also carried out on grids and rubric assessment. And the system was also carried out. Number four is implement. Uh, this is activities were carried out using the system for student taking computing course. The activities uh, carried out was the student upload to 
recruiting videos uh, to the system. For the first is video was an offline teaching practice, and the second was an online teaching practice. Okay, and the last is evaluate. In this evaluation stage, in addition, uh, at the evaluation stage, data collecting of learning outcome was also carried out. Okay, and this is uh, our results. This is, uh, so this system was published in HTTP assessment microteaching.com. Uh, before we are logging in the system, we must uh, write our username and password in the system. And we are, can see this a window. This is uh, the project of the uh, students. Where the first is video uh, online, and the second is video offline. And this is the uh, how uh, the lecturers and the and their friends uh, will uh, input the scores. Okay, this is uh, the figures of online learning outcome, as you see, and this is the offline learning outcome. So that the results of the score of its of the uh, 53 student as a sample in this research, uh, and the average score is 87.12. Which was classification as very good. And then for the le offline learning outcomes, uh, this is also we use uh, 53 students, and they have scores, average score is 87.65. Uh, and the category is very good also. So, uh, I have conclusion of this research based on the results of the this, this research. Uh, the content expert test showed that the instrument was found with the Gregory score 1.0. The instrument was integrated with a web base to apply the peer assessment. The response analyzed results showed that digital assessment was practical with means of 130.26. The online learning outcomes analyzed research was 87.12, which is very good. The result of offline learning outcome was 87.65, which category is very good also. So, conclusive kind of this peer assessment was great, is supporting micro teaching learning process in micro teaching calls. I want to say thank you also to Universitas Pendidikan Ganesa, uh, Drew Gipa funds in 2022 for finding this research. Thank you also uh, to the Informatic Engineering Education Study Program and Faculty of Engineering Vocational Indexa who helps facilities did research. Okay, that's all of my presentation and thank you.